So, I wonder. I'm pull game. I wonder what I saw. Welcome to the wonderful world of Pokemon. But that did not happen. So now every time I move on this table, it's going to destroy everybody's ears. That's a good time. Our beloved Galar region is a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with which we share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. Thanks to help from these mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. In the sea, in the sky, and even with us in our towns. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete, we call Pokemon trainers. Yep. Oh, but I'm getting carried away. Please allow me to introduce myself. I don't know if this guy's actually Elon Musk or not. I don't know. My name is Rose, and it's a pleasure to be here. Now turn your gaze to the Galar region's greatest Pokemon trainer, your undefeated champion, Champion Leon's Exhibition Match. I wish there was a way... To turn down the ISO of this camera. Oh, check this out. <clears throat> Let's see here. I'm missing out on stuff. My controller's going nuts. Come on now. <laughs> Camera control. Exposure. This is what I need here. Hello, hello. Hello. This badge I'm wearing on my pants. Oh, that your flash new phone, HRG? Were you watching Lee's exhibi exhibition? Is that a phone? That's a tablet, dude. Are you watching Lee's exhibition match on it? But you can't cheer him on with your hands full. You know the only way to properly cheer on Lee would be his famous Charizard pose. Hot, didn't expect to see you here today, dear. Mm-hmm. That's exactly why I came running over. Never mind watching the match now. I've got it recording at home anyway. I record all my brother's matches. Come with me, HRG. He should be here any minute. And Lee does stuff with the trigger so I can't read the box. Now I've got to run. See you at mine later. I hate this chair that I'm in. Wake up, Munchlax. What my plan is to just play this and catch up to where I'm at in my game. And then pick back up with my, my game, especially if nobody watches. Where do the parents sleep? Like, I guess that's a room there. 
They've at least got a room that goes somewhere that you can't get in. Brushing off. Didn't even say bring your bag. Saw it in your room. Don't forget to grab a hat. money so no extra money bummer no money Look at you, that old bag looks like it could pull you over. At least we know that it should hold anything Lee might bring, even if it's a Snorlax. A Wooloo, but what's it doing here? Or there? Or anywhere? Nava, this is Pokemon. Hello, Pineapple, thank you for the host. Where's my, where's my alerts? What's going on here? Oh. There's my alerts. Hi guys. But yeah, this is the uh this is the new Pokemon. You listen, no going past that fence. No. Everyone knows there are scary Pokemon in there. Meh. Now that that's taken care of. Oh, Lord. How about it? Let's race. Bet I can make it to my house first. I bet you I let you just because I don't want to deal with you. Mainly because I've already played this part of the game. <laughs> Once. Just by walking around. So this is old boy's house. Let's see here. Hang on a second. I'll get this up here where I can see it. I was looking for you. All right. This game is everything that I hate. It, it's got everything that I hate about Skyward Sword in it. It's just, it's like, come on. You gotta go over here and do this thing before we'll let you go out in the thing and do the stuff you want to do. There you are at last. Oh, you brought along me. Hello. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? Have you got him crammed in a cupboard? He's still not here yet for the hundredth time. Honestly, you must learn some patience, Hop. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wedgehurst. And that's where I'm going. You know, Lee is hopeless with directions. Oh, Lee, 
guys, that's probably for the best. You've got to come with. Oh, gosh. I hate that phrase. Come with. Uh, you've still never met my big bro, right? You can't miss out on your chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you out on the route. Alright. I love playing this part of the game again. I know you're the reliable sort. I'll have everything ready for a barbecue in the... Okay, I'll go. Can we do this in real life? I dig an IRL barbecue. Hi, Dad. Hop's dad. <coughs> His brother is a superhero. Let's go upstairs. Leon's so busy that he hardly comes home, but I would like to keep his room clean and tidy. Alright, I've done enough snooping. Um... Nava, if you are in here, I need to know if my audio is too quiet. Pixel was saying it was too quiet the other day, and now I'm all worried about it. Let's get a move on. Only remember, wild Pokemon can come out of nowhere if you walk through patches of tall grass. I've got Wooloo, so I'm ready for a battle against wild Pokemon. But not you, so we'll steer clear of the grass. Pineapple, if you're here, you can tell me about it, too. I, I don't know who's here. Let's go and meet Lee at the station. Oh, it's, it's dead ahead from here. No wandering into tall grass. Okay. At least the game is pretty. Uh. <sighs> hello, hello, Edgehurst. Your champion Leon is back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. Our unbeatable champion Leon, you and Charizard are the greatest. Well, thank you for that. I hope you all carry on training up your Pokemon, then come challenge me for the champion title. We're on it. We've all been working on our battle skills just like you've taught us to, Lee. But that Charizard of yours is too strong for the likes of us to take on too true that Charizard is blazingly strong. But other Pokemon can be strong as well. That's why I want the strongest of challengers to fill the gym challenge and come battle me. My wish is for Galar's, Galar's trainers to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Brawr. Lee? So my number one fan in all the world has come out of his way to pick me up. Look at you, Hop. I reckon you've grown exactly one inch. Oh, an inch and a quarter. Since the last time I saw you, I got ahead of myself. Bingo. That's the sort of sharp eye that's kept you undefeated so long, eh, Lee? And these bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be HR. HR I can't say my own name. Am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm the Galar region's greatest ever Pokemon champion. And a massive Charizard fan too. Who wasn't? People call me the unbeatable Leon. Come on, Lee. And you, HRG. Bet I can beat both of you back home. That hop. Always wanting to be the best, isn't he? 
with a proper excuse me with a proper rival of his own I bet he'd push himself to become something truly special well everyone I bid you farewell for today but don't you fret I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Galar can have a champion time look at all of his sponsors I wonder if Coke Gaming sponsors him uh -uh. Come on, Lee, you promised us. You brought HRG and me Pokemon. You did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's showtime, everyone. Take a good look, you two. Type Pokemon Grookey, the Fire Type Pokemon Scorbunny, and the Water Type Pokemon Sobble. Go on, pick your first. I've already got my Wulu after all. So we got the Grookey. Got a Grookey. We got the Score Bunny. I think we're going with Sobble. Yeah. No. So it'll be Sobble for you. Nice one. And I'll go with Score Bunny. You're mine. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You and I'll be doing some serious training. Bow. Bye. I bet you will be, Hop. That's why I brought along these Pokemon for you and HRG. So the two of you can battle and train and grow stronger together to try to reach me. And 
you'll come with me. Charizard will show you the ropes. He's strict, but real strong and real kind, too. Charizard will roast that thing, dude. Alright, enough of all this trainer nonsense. For one night, dinner's ready. Children, bring all your Pokemon and let's eat. I want to be there. The next day. You spent the whole night with that new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two getting on all, all you two getting on all right, understanding one another. Maybe even built up a bit of love. Of course I have. HRG's made fast friends with his Sobble too. Then listen up, new trainers. Believe in yourself and your Pokemon. I need more sound. If you trust in one another and carry on battling side by side long enough, then someday you might even become worthy rivals for me, the unbeatable champion. What are you looking at him for, Lee? I'm the one who will be coming to challenge you. If you think HRG might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. But I'm not planning to lose to him and miss out on my chance to beat, a, beat the unbeatable champion. Just having a Pokemon with you doesn't make you a real trainer, you know. Proper trainers raise their Pokemon up to be first rate in battle, too. Oh, and you think you're worthy of calling yourself such a proper trainer already, Hop? Guess I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in a battle against your friend if he's up for it. What do you say? Willing and ready to take Hop in on in the first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Uh-huh. He's got my weakness. He's got... I've got his weakness. <laughs> Believe in your partner, Pokemon, and care for them too with all your heart. Do these two things and I'm certain you'll learn to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, to have a champion time battling with them. Looks like everyone's on board, Pokemon and trainers alike. And let's do this. I've watched every match that Lee's ever had. I've read every book and magazine he left behind at home too. I know exactly what to do in order to win. Boy. After I mute second me. Alright. Oh, he's starting with Woo Woo. I don't have any water moves. What? This is an outrage. There's my water move. It's not over yet. I've had another trusty ally to my team after all. There's this other earbud. So I actually want to put it in. I can actually still hear the music over the mic. So things I don't like about the new game, I can't hit select and bring that up. I guess it's fine, but whatever. Do 
Did you already know about type advantages? <laughs> yes, I did, game. My two Pokemon with your one? You and your Sobble are too much. Well, that was a shock. Guess I know now why Lee thought he should give you a Pokemon too. You and your Pokemon all fought hard. Made me almost want to let out Charizard and join in on all the fun. Three way battle! Good effort out there, Sobble. Why don't I get you all sorted? To heck with Score Bunny. And HRG, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rival to Hop, would you? Push him. Make both of you stronger. I already want to get stronger and stronger. You've seen me battle now, Lee, so come on. You've got to let me take on the Pokemon Gym. You? Join the Gym Challenge? You think you're ready for the single greatest competition in the Galar region? Not putting the cart before the Rapidash there, little brother. If that's really what you want to do, you have a whole lot you learn about Pokemon. Especially your friend HRG. Before you think about getting gym badges, best to think about getting a Pokedex. The trainer's Pokedex helps them learn lots of things about all the Pokemon out there, including their strengths. But it's more than just a collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion. Pokemon training. Right, right, we get it. Pokedex is then. We're on it. See, that's who I want to be. I want to be Hop. Like, just let me... I, I, I'm i Hop in real world. In the real world. I just want to get going. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'll let the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so completing a simple Pokedex will be nothing. Just another page in the tale of my legend. You'd probably go tell your mom that we're heading out, though. Alright. Did you hear that? No. It just blew up my speakers. It... The gate's open, and the Wooloo that was there. I was tackling, that, tackling the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think it actually broke through there. Do you? But it's off limits. Nobody's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in a real state. And that was nothing compared to the earful she got from the professor afterward. <laughs> what did you say? Gotta save it. Right? Even if we're not supposed to, this is the kind of scene where you simply have to do what's needed. Hope you're ready for anything because we're going in. Slumbering. Ooh, where do you think it got off to? No. Fog is really coming on thick. If we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble.
Did you get ahead of me? Let's be sure you're in tip top shape. Oh, look, a free heal. Move that away from the speaker a little bit, it's triggering the gate. Did you hear that? Is that a Pokemon crying out, you think? I'm just gonna stand here and spin and do the... Yeah. That thing. I gotta say, I'm glad we finally got a console Pokemon game. But I do miss the touchpad of the 3DS. It was perfect for this. trouble. Fog's getting deeper. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in my face. In front of my face. I think I get now why this place is off limits. See anything? You okay? I can't see anything. HRG. Oh, Lee, how'd you manage to find your way here? Your pants... Your pants with direction. You always get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been waiting ages for you two and you never showed. Of course I came looking for you both. 
Wait, where's the Wooloo? We were trying to rescue that Wooloo. Bah. Little chap is just fine. Though all of you had fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds, but it took courage to come in here and all the same, and I can understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. At least that Wooloo's alright. Yeah, HRG. I thought we'd had it when that weird fog started rolling in and that mad Pokemon attack. At least it wasn't all for nothing. Attacked by some mad Pokemon? What are you talking about, Hop? It seemed loads stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen, and just had this sort of presence. Our moves didn't even touch it. I mean, really, they seemed to pass right through it. Their moves passed right through it. So the fearsome Pokemon they say, li say live in the slubbering well, wield. Are they actually illusions or something? Getting strong enough and maybe the getting, getting get strong enough and maybe the two of you could be the ones to reveal the truth someday. For now, let's simply get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with this dude. Even if we did get an earful from Lee, what an experience. This will make a pretty fine first page in the first tale of my legend. Don't forget to tell your mum we're off to Wedgehurst now. You'll go spare if you leave without a word. Even worse than Lee just did. <clears throat> Alright. Well now, isn't Sobble just a sweetheart? And yes, I heard the news from both young, from, from young Leon. I'm glad someone bothered to tell me. Off to Wedgehurst, aren't you? <clears throat> Here we are. A bit of pocket money for your journey. Buy yourself a little something at the Pokemon Center. Maybe some potions or something. Remember that Sobble will battle to the very end for you. So don't go pushing the poor deer too hard. Blah. And you, Sobble, look after my little HRG. Come home to rest any time that you need. After all, east or west, home is best. <clears throat> Stuff. Free heals. <sighs> you couldn't find the door there. Here we go. This is quite the big step, you know. My first step towards becoming the next champion. Guess I'll probably train up Score Bunny by bit by having it battle against Pokemon in the grass. See, this is what I'm telling, I'm talking about. It's like I don't need this explanation at the beginning of every game. I know new players do. I get that. Uh, yeah, I would. <laughs> Uh, this this is this is the thing to me that's like Skyward Sword that made me so irritable with it. It's like I know that this is what this game is about. I don't need you to tell me every time. Let me go do my thing. When did I get Pokeballs? Got five of them though. Just gonna chuck a Pokeball then. Check that out. I'm such a Pokemon master, I don't need to fight. I just throw the ball and they get in it.
catching the Pokemons. Time for me to have a woo woo. those levels. Nope. <laughs> that one just ran. Uh-uh. I don't want no part of that dude. Pull out one of my other Pokemon. I'm afraid that one will kill it. One of them old ones that you can't get all of them anymore. <laughs> I can't get this one one way or the other. I have no Pokeballs. I'll catter people. How's everybody out there doing? I hope you're enjoying your evening. Almost got some more levels.
The squobits are terrified of me. I know what I ought to get instead of using this microphone here. I get one of those headsets like the uh, Southern Gospel folks use. They just earned like the not Southern Gospel. They use it too though. Um, the headset mic. I understand why people use those now. But you can't beat these microphones. They're great for broadcast. Uh, before I mess around anymore, I need some Pokeballs. Ultimate Charizard! What? I didn't know that was a thing. <clears throat> okay. Let's go exploring because I don't remember what's around. Welcome to the Pokemon. May I help you? $1,000? Freaking rich. You see, out of the window of a tree, it was so changing. That's lovely. Rain has been delayed due, or, due to a rail car inspection. Um. Champions here. I've just remembered what the sign here used to say. To the right is the Pokemon Lab. On the opposite side is the station. Just go barge in people's houses. And their grand building beside us is the research lab. But if Professor Magnolia, if it's, you'll find her at home down the far end of Route Two. I hate these fake doors. Like, I get, they're there, like, they're telling us, like, we get it. There needs to be rooms for the people to sleep in. I want to go in them. Well done, you reached the goal and managed to find the Pokemon Research Lab. <coughs> you did a far sight better than I did my first time. I'm hopeless with directions. See how your world has already grown? All thanks to having Pokemon with you. I'm, I know I'm sure glad I got Charizard. I've got Charizard with me. Keep me from getting lost all the time. Now in we go. I've got to give it to Professor Magnolia. Everything in here looks fascinating. What is it today, Leon? Looking for info on another never-before-seen super-strong Pokémon? I wish you'd stop with these outlandish requests. Good to see you too, Yamper. Yamper here is a real champ when it comes to helping you find your way around. He came to my rescue plenty of times back in the day when I got lost on the road. Oh yeah, and that's his trainer, Sonya. What can I say about Sonya? Well, I like the way she cooks. 
He makes food you can gobble down in a flash. What kind of an introduction is that? Did you forget we were rivals during our gym challenge? It wasn't just Yamper helping you out. I did too. Anyway, it's nice to meet you. Name's Sonia. I'm the professor's I'm the professor's assistant. This is HRG. He's a new Pokemon trainer. Set him on the right path, would you? You think I am? He's always got his head in the clouds. It's no wonder he gets lost all the time. Oh, looks like you've got a Rotom phone. Hey there, Rotom. <laughs> Rotom phones are handy little things, aren't they? They've got a map and a navigation tool. That said, Leon still gets lost, so... Oh, sorry, so tell me, do you know a lot about Pokemon? Well said. In that case, I'll make it so you can use the Pokedex on your phone. Yay. Just so you know, that Pokedex is a gift from my Gran. Could you let Gran know that you received the Pokedex? She lives in a in the house down along Route 2. Nope. Is there anything in here for me to pilfer? Information on Gigantamaxing. Alright. Hey there, trainer. Sorry to stop you. You just left the Pokemon lab, right? So that means you've got a Pokedex, yeah? I love talking to new trainers and giving them useful stuff. I got a potion. Free heals. Alright, dude. So the train station's probably still down. So I'm gonna do a thing real quick. I'll be right back.